Good morning and welcome in. I am the Canadian trucker Rudy and I am here with Diego. I'm Trucker's Rudy's son. Well, thank you guys for joining my channel and stay tuned for the rest of my day. Good morning, good morning everyone. We are leaving Steinbach. Today is Tuesday, the 26th I believe it is. Yep. And they are closing this, uh, I don't know what you would call it, but this turn that we could usually go onto that street there, or come right across here. Right here by Panners here in Steinbach, they're closing it off. Yeah. So I guess we will no longer be able to uh, turn there. Alright. We're going to go down to the uh, co-op. And fuel up. Not the co-op that's right here. Uh, the co-op that's a little further down the road. So I to that Mr. Penner. We'll fuel her up and then we will put the hammer down. We are apparently on our way to New Hampshire. Yeah. So our load is going to take us through Ontario again, except it's going to be the other way this time. Usually we come this way, now we're going to go that way. What I mean by that is that way is east, this way is westbound. Yep. We're going to go east through Ontario this time. Same trip. We came back a couple of days ago. Now we're just going the opposite. Oh well. Nothing I can do about it. Would have been nicer to go through the US. But hey. It's a little shorter miles going this way. But. What you guys will get to see is. You will get to see probably Montreal unless something goes wrong. What I'm talking about is Montreal, Quebec. Now my French ain't nothing to be proud of, but nor do I want to know how to speak French. That's just me. <laughs> Not that again, nothing against French people. I just don't like Montreal, to be honest with you. It's terrible roads up there. Also, not very good drivers up there. They're always cutting you off and honking the horn at you. It's kind of like driving in South America. Like road rage up there all the time. And it's terrible rush hour traffic up there usually. Oh well, we'll try to get through there. Uh, when it's not rush hour, if possible. If not, if not, I guess. Anyways, let's uh, go fuel up over here. The next light, that's where we're gonna turn, fuel up. Then we'll be on our married way. Alrighty guys, we are in Dryden, Ontario. We just stopped here in uh, Dryden at the Husky for a little bit. Just went inside and used the restroom, basically, and uh, Dryden isn't very big, at least not in this area. There might be a little bigger this way, but this way doesn't seem to be very big. So we got the Walmart right here to the right, and that's about it pretty much. And we're pretty much through Dryden. But it is a gorgeous, gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous day out here today. We are somewhere around the 80 Fahrenheit mark right now. 25 Celsius. It's just absolutely gorgeous. Oh yeah.
Cracks in the concrete Breaking the ground beneath your feet Always threatening The stars are exploding And all that you know is crumbling Cry yourself to sleep I can't save you now I can't save you now I can't save you now I don't know how Alrighty guys, we are in Nipigon, Ontario. I don't know if you can see that big flag up there, but uh, hey, we're just gonna go for a little bit of a walk down here. Inspect everything, make sure our lights are working. I got a livestock truck over here. This is how they uh, close it up for when it's a little bit cooler. It's a little bit cool out here today, so so yeah, I just figured I'd show you guys a little bit of the uh, Canadian truck stop. Let's have a look at the Canadian truck stop up here. Like I said, we are at the Husky here in Nipigon, Ontario. We actually got another pennant truck right here beside me. And uh, uh, so we're done for today. We're not really in a hurry, so. Just doing a little bit of a walk around, check everything, do our post trip basically. Yeah, yeah, I guess you could say post trip. Everything is looking good. So, I guess we will uh, probably go inside and use the restroom or whatever, and then we'll see what we will do for the rest of the day. Yeah. Any of this, let's go inside and take care of some business and then uh, we will be back a little bit later, I guess, to close the show. Alrighty, guys, I just want to wish you guys a very pleasant day whenever you get to watch this and uh, wanted to say good night to everyone. So we will see you again tomorrow at 2 a.m., some of you. Some of you might be waiting till the end of the day when you watch this, but... No matter what, we will see you again tomorrow. So have a good one and stay tuned for the next one. It's time to get going. It's time to move on. Put this behind me. That day is gonna come.